Hi everyone. Today we bring you to weekly insights on resolving errors and warnings. Capricorn Technologies, Technologies, a a zero company having a legacy of of over three decades, has now become a partner of choice for AAC industry. Capricorn Technologies is one of the biggest platinum partners of Autodesk and Venture, along with Authorized Training Center. Today, with over 10 offices across India and 300 plus inspired team members, Capricorn is serving over 20,000 customers in the building, infrastructure, manufacturing, and a large number of other industries. Myself, Dipali Arora, so solution specialist in structures, Capricorn Technologies, New Delhi, will present you with weekly insights on resolving errors and warnings. This insight will enable you to concentrate on fixing errors and warnings of various kinds like warning property for members, for duplicate members basically, and the properties like warning showing uh, the members coming in the same joints, elastic modulus warning or error you can say, and also if there is any often node or you can say independent or uh, node connected uh, joint is there. Okay, so I'll be uh, using this structure for this insight today. First of all, let's run the structure and see what are the warnings and, and errors coming. I'll go to analysis and design. I'll go on run analysis. It will take a moment. Okay, so there are 18 errors and four warnings. Click on view output file and done. Okay, let's uh, solve the problems, warnings and errors one by one. So our first warning is that 3025 member and 30232 member number is coming between the same joint. 3029 and 3033 are also coming between the same joint. This warning means you have a duplicate member in your structure. Let's see how we can see the duplicate members in our structures. What you have to do is click on view. Go to select option over here. No, sorry. Click on this utility options. Click on this beam tool. Click on duplicate beams. See 3025, 3032. And this is 3029 and 3033. This means this is a duplicate member. And this is also a duplicate member. So just Click on this remove all duplicates. A dialog box will come. It will say the second and additional duplicate beams listed will be removed from the model along with associated data confirmed to continue. Just click on OK. Now we'll uh, again run this and see if the same warnings are coming or not for that particular uh, members. Go to analysis, click on run and analysis, save. See, earlier there were four warnings and 18 errors. So that means some of the errors has been removed. Let's see now. Okay, see, that warning is removed. Now let's go to another warning, which is joint number 69 not connected. Okay, if part of control or dependent. And this is the structure is disjointed. Means there is some orphan node. Means there is some uh, node which is not connected to any member or uh, anything like that. So let's see, uh, just I'll, shift, I'll press shift K on the screen. And to see the nodes number, you can press shift N. See, a uh, warning was node number 69, which means this node number. And you, if you want to see if there is any orphan nodes in your uh, structure, Procedure will be same. Go to utilities. Click on this node tool now. And click on this orphan node. See. All the orphan nodes will be highlighted. In my structure, there is only one orphan node. So, I'll just click on delete. And I'll say OK. And also, if you want to see any duplicate nodes, go to node tools and select duplicate nodes. There is no duplicate node in my structure. So, it will say no duplicate nodes. Now, we will again run the structure. And see, and see if the same warnings are coming or not. 
it will take a moment okay so now there are zero warnings only 14 errors are there now we'll solve the errors problem okay i'll click on done and let's see what errors are coming okay there is an error of elastic modulus is missing in the members section properties are missing in the members so i would just like to tell you if you're uh, after running your structure if error comes like elastic modulus is not missing is not entered a section properties are missing this means uh, your structure uh, there is a, like a member which is not assigned to any property like not even a column property not even a uh, beam property that is why this error is showing up let's see how to see if all the sections are assigned to a property or not go to this select toolbar over here click on the select click on missing property click on missing elasticity this means these are the members which are not assigned to any property if you want to see you can also click on missing property like i told you missing elasticity is directly proportional to missing property if you'll assign the properties missing elasticity uh, will automatically uh, go like if i just assign the property <laughs> What is elasticity? Young modulus elasticity, right? That means material is also not assigned. If we'll assign any, suppose I'll assign this property to these members also. I'll just simply click on this property and select the members and I'll click on assign to selected beams, assign. And material of this beam is concrete. So automatically young modulus elasticity will also be assigned. Now, now just simply click on analysis and design. Run analysis, save. See, zero errors. And 193 warnings because uh, I've already assigned loads and everything to the structure. So all those errors and warnings that were showing up has been removed now. Thank you for watching the video. I hope you guys had an insightful session. We shall be presenting with how to create uh, and assign plates in your structure in our next insight. For more videos and updates, do subscribe our channel Capricorn Technologies Private Limited and comment if you like the insight. We would be delighted to hear from you. Please reach out to us. For any suggestions, query or topic you would like to discuss. See you next week. Thank you so much.